Hi, I'm Cosmo Iraci. I'm from Mississauga. My family's from Calabria. Today we're making patelle. For the fritters, to make the fritters, we have zucchini, obviously, one egg, flour, parmesan, and any herb you have fresh from the garden, beautiful to make it fragrant, salt, that's it. So to make the patelle, first thing we need to do is grate the zucchini. Now I'm gonna put salt with the zucchini, season it nice, maybe three pinches. I'm gonna add the basil, parsley, and one egg. Now we use simple tools, all we need is a fork. We're gonna combine all the wet ingredients. And if you need to add a little more wet, just water is all you need. Parmesan, the Parmesan's gonna add lots of flavor. And we're gonna slowly incorporate the flour to the consistency that will make the fritter a fritter. I love the fresh, it reminds me of summer, it reminds me of my nonna. Just the garden planting, it's beautiful. My nonna is the best cook out of eight siblings. I always watched her cook, my mom always cooked, I was always around it, I just enjoy food. And it's about there. You want it wet, but you don't want it too wet. And there you have it. Okay, now we gotta get our fryer oil going. Once we fry the patelli, you need something to go with it. Here we have some beautiful garden tomatoes. We uh, seasoned up with salt, olive oil, oregano, basil, fresh from the garden, beautiful, you don't have to do much. And we have our family's super sahata. We make every year and it's always a beautiful accompaniment. And uh, any cheese you have, Parmigiano, this one today, I have the Piave, Stravecchio. Simple, Italian cooking is simple, beautiful. Who doesn't want to eat it just like that? So the key to making the patelle, you want to oil your spoon, so when you go into your batter, it slides right off beautifully. So I put it up top, yeah, that's okay, tap it down, and then I go around in a clockwise formation so I know what to flip first. My nonna came over uh, an hour before I came today to show me, make sure everything's done right. I gotta do her proud. This is a very traditional nonna kind of dish. Simple, a few items, a few ingredients, that's it. Anybody can make it at home. Today's zucchini and tomatoes, we got from Enzo. Delivers fresh protos here at Cucinato during the summer. Here we're gonna set up a little plate. There you go, guys. We have the fresh patelli we made, some tomatoes from Enzo's garden, homemade soppressata, and the Piave Stravecchio. And there you have it, lunch.